Hey everybody, it's 1312 Man, you know what today is? Today is day 27 of 31 days of Halloween. That's right, day 27 and 31 days. We got four days left. Huh. What a bummer. But for day 27, what did I choose? I chose a, a lot of the, a lot of the movies that are coming up, you know, like yesterday's, which was um, The Uninvited, you know, today's. A lot of them are more modern. I mean, I have done a lot of classic 80s stuff and earlier than that, you know, with the Hitchcock stuff, but, um, but a good portion of what's coming up right now is, is the more 2000 stuff, and, and today we're talking about a film that's not really that, that old, it, did, what year did it come out, I'm not sure, whatever, um, it's not that old, it came out just a few years back, and that is The Conjuring. Okay, so most of the time when I give a synopsis of what a movie's about, you know, it's really short and really, you know, not not given a whole lot of detail. But I'm pretty sure most people out there have seen The Conjuring. Um, it's a movie about Ed and Lorraine Warren. Uh, the are uh, I don't want to say they're ghost hunters. You know, they're they they do it. They're, they're paranormal investigators is the best way to put it. You know, they go to places that they believe might be haunted, and then they try to figure out why. Why Why is there a noise in the middle of the night? And it could be something from a water heater to an actual ghost. You know, I mean, water heater could be making a noise that they didn't know that, that it made, and it's starting to go or something like that. Or, or it could just be like a branch, you know, tapping on a window that... No one ever saw that branch there before. It just finally grew long enough to hit the window, you know. No one's paying attention. I don't know. Stuff like that. But it could actually be very spiritual uh, and very ghost-like. And so they go out there and they investigate. They try to figure out what's right, what's wrong. And um, in this case, they go out to a house. And this is a very creepy movie. This this is one of those movies that, that has a... I mean, if you believe in Ed and Lorraine Warren, then, you know, so so be it. Uh, there are a lot of people that don't like Ed and Lorraine Warren because they were the ones that investigated the Amityville house back in the 70s. And they feel that, I mean, there's a big, there's a big to-do on whether or not the Amityville house was real or if it was faked and if Ed and Lorraine Warren helped fake it or whatever. You know, I mean, that's all hearsay. We're never going to know the truth behind it. You know, uh, I mean, Ron DeFeo Jr. states that he was told by a by an entity to do what he did. So, whatever. It is what it is. But The Conjuring is just one of the one of the many cases that they that they um, investigated. It spawned a sequel, Conjuring Two, and it spawned a couple of spinoffs. You know, Annabelle and The Nun. And I really like this series. I think the series itself is really good. Um, as far as the movies overall, I mean, I like The Conjuring. I think The Conjuring 2 is just a slight bit freakier, you know, but that's just me. Um, the first Annabelle movie, I liked, you know, because it had more of a, more of a um, Rosemary's Baby feel to it. And Annabelle Creation didn't really care for it, but I love The Nun. So there you go. Four out of five, I liked. And this was the first one. I know a couple people. I know at least one person, Leo, over at the Dorkening, had to watch this movie with the lights on. You know, um, there's more to that story, but I I just think it's kind of funny. But yeah, so it's a well acted, well put together movie. Looks great. Has a nice '70s feel to it. You know, they they managed to get a lot of the stuff right for the for the look and the feel. And, uh, yeah, so that's my day 27 for my 31 days of Halloween, you know. It's The Conjuring. I mean, come on. It's it's going to be something that you all know. And, like I said, I, I didn't really give much away for the actual plot of this movie. I'm just saying that this is one of the cases that they investigated. So if you haven't seen it, check it out. I highly recommend it. As always, like, subscribe, share, and comment. I always want to know what you have to say. And when you do subscribe, hit the bell. 
That way you'll be notified whenever I put something new up. As always, I am the 13th Wolfman, and yep, 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 I'm on the prowl.